afternoon, everybody. Uh, I'm Amanda Watson. Uh, I'm on the Northwest Committee uh, of the PM Forum. Um, just want to welcome you to today's uh, webinar. Um, finally, I wanted to talk about Active Campaign, which you may or may not have heard of. Um, it's definitely a newer player on the market compared to HubSpot and Pardot. Um, Active Campaign is a budget friendly platform. But I like to think of it as a budget-friendly platform with a bit of bite <laughs> because the features that it does come with are um, really quite amazing considering the price tag that it comes with. Um, you really have access to amazing um, automation and segmentation features. Um, you can connect it up with things like Salesforce, with Slack, and really automate a lot of your marketing. And I think the big thing about um, Google Analytics as well, like any kind of web data and its data, is that it gives you context to your numbers. So it's not just a case of understanding we've got X number of sessions. It's about where they're coming from. Are you seeing a growth in a certain area? So it's understanding how people are using your site and also understanding what is driving people, users to your site. So what content is driving users to your site? Uh, what piece of, um, of uh, you know, data that, that people are engaging with? And also on the flip side, what are your pressure points? Where... where are you losing users? So the first one I'm going to talk about is Canva. So this is a design software. Um, it's um, It has got a free option. I've, I'm on the pro, pro option, but it's actually not very expensive. Um, it's about sort of maybe $9 a month per user. Um, it has got its own, it's got photos built into it. So if you wanted to search for photos, you could, and they're all royalty free. So that, that takes away any issues you've got in terms of, of royalty and licensing. Um, you can upload different things. So I've got client logos in here. So as I say, this is a bit of a dump on this slide as to a small handful of the 202 and the 53 that they're currently rolling out changes that are coming. Um, it's nice to know that not only are the changes there for user friendliness uh, for, for us as we're using it, uh, but it's the end-to-end -end encry encryption for video calls, making it safer. Uh, the putting an out-of-office function on. Uh, currently, it is just a, a colour where it'll say green, you're in, you're active, red, you're in a meeting, or a funny little um, circle thing if, if you're not online at all. <laughs> 